This video will focus in on interpreting a line plot. So here's a line plot, and we all we know that line plots should always have a title. Um, any graph should have a title. It lets us know what the uh, data is representing. So it says water consumption of 10-year-old students. Um, the X's are the number of students, and the numbers along the bottom are the amount of water in cups. So if I'm looking at this graph, I just have to be able to interpret it to be able to tell what is, you know, look at it and say, what is it telling me? Here are some things that I've gathered from that. Well, first of all, I can see that the line plot shows how much, how much water 11 students drank. And the reason I know that is I counted my X's, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So I can see that 11 students, this data represents 11 students. Another thing that I noticed is that one student did not drink any water. I can see here zero. Out of all 11, there was only one that did not uh, drink any water. Another thing I noticed is that four students drank a half a cup of water. And I can see that because I can see four X's on top of the half a cup, which is the same as two fourths. So one fourth, two fourths, three fourths. I recognize that eight students drank a half a cup of water or more. And the reason I know that is a half a cup or more. So that includes these four, one, two, three, four, and then anybody greater than that half. So that would be four, five, six, seven, eight. And then finally, three students drank less than half a cup of water. So drank less than half. That means I do not include these. No, I do not include it. I include everything below a half. One, two, three. There's a lot more information um, that you can gather from this data, but that was just a couple that I gathered from interpreting the line plot. Now you try, can try some on your own.